In this video, we will see how to clip a raster by mask layer in QGIS. Here we have the raster layer. Let's turn on this. We also have a study area polygon layer. We will use this polygon layer as a mask layer and clip our raster with the shape of this polygon. For that, go to the processing menu and toolbox. In the processing toolbox, expand GDAL and then again expand raster extraction and here you will find clip raster by mask layer. Double click on this. Here we need to input some values. The input layer should be our uh, raster layer since we have only one layer it is shown here then we need to select the mask layer it should be a vector layer so we have only one vector layer it's already selected now if we want to select the source and target CRS uh, then we can uh, select this but since these are optional we can skip these options if we want to select extend for our raster layer we can select it from here but uh, it is optional it will be automatically automatically calculated based on our vector layer now there is an option for uh, assign a specified no data value if we want to set a value for no data then we can set here zero or something like that but since it is optional we can uh, leave it as is there are some other options for x resolution and y resolution if we want to uh, make the pixel size of our own custom size then we need to add these values but uh, these fields are also optional we can skip this as well and after that we can run this let's close this you can see that our raster layer has been clipped with our polygon shape if we turn off this bigger image then we can see that our image is clipped but there are some other black pixels here if you do not want these black pixels uh, outside of our area you can use uh, generate an alpha channel now let's do that click again the clip raster by mask layer and then turn on this option create an output alpha band and run again close now if we close this image you can see that our image has no outside black pixels that we previously have in that image since this is a satellite imagery it has uh, so many bands so let's make some symbology to make it uh, rgb true color band so it's sentinel image so we need to use band 4 for red 3 for green and 2 for blue for true color composite and press ok like our source image if we want the exact visualization of our source image we need to copy the uh, visualization parameters of the source image let's go to the properties and see the symbology you can copy these values we can see that for the red band the minimum value is around 1100 and for the green and blue band is around 1200 so now let's close this 
and go to the properties of this make it an event 100 and this to 1200 and apply okay now the image is close to our source image in this point we can export our image go to export service and make a name press ok and let's copy the symbol of the of this one to our output image thanks for watching